my friends are here. Hello, friends. Yay, you came. I'm so glad you're here because guess what time it is? <gasps> you already know. It's story time. Here I am in my story time chair, and I am so excited. I have another Adventures of Sea Kids to read for you today. This one is called I'm Not Afraid by Leanne Mancini and illustrated by Dan Sharp. Are you ready? I'm ready because I don't want to be afraid either. Let's see what the sea kids say today. Oh, wait, first of all, I have to take off my gloves, don't I? Because I can't turn the pages. I need my fingers. All right, here we go. Susie and her best friend, Rachel, swam as fast as they could to the undersea amusement park. Amusement park? Are you kidding? Did you know there was an amusement park under the sea? Well, maybe it's just pretend. Let's see what they did. The games and rides were so colorful and very scary, too. The whaleback roller coaster was a monster of a ride. It's my first time coming here. The whaleback roller coaster is so tall, said Susie. Are you afraid? asked Rachel. Oh, no, not me. Sharks are brave. I'm not afraid of anything, said Susie. Can you see the big sign that says Undersea Amusement Park? Oh, I see what I see is kind of like a, a Ferris wheel that has a star. Ooh, let's look and see if we can see more about this roller coaster. Turn the page. The whaleback roller coaster was 75 feet tall. It was taller than anything Rachel and Susie had ever seen. The cars zoomed past them so fast that the rush of the water almost knocked them down. The lobster circle basket and the starfish Ferris wheel looked like fun, Susie said. Come on, Susie, let's ride the whaleback roller coaster, Rachel said in excitement. Oh, wow. They look very excited. Do you ever get excited? Have you ever been to an amusement park? I don't know. Let's see what happens next. Turn the page. No, I'm hungry. Let's eat some french fries first and then some cotton candy, answered Susie. I'll need lots of energy to ride the whale back. <laughs> Look, her mouth is full of french fries. Oh, and I see a big pink cotton candy. Rachel said, well, I guess I can wait. After the girls ate their french fries and cotton candy, they were so full they could hardly move. Oh, have you done that before? Did you ever eat so much? Ooh, your tummy was so full. Well, what do you think they did? I don't know. Let's turn the page. The girls swam around until their tummies felt better. Then Rachel said, now let's ride the whale back roller coaster. Susie answered, not yet. Let's go play some games first. Mm. What do you think Susie is doing? Mm. We'll turn the page and see. <laughs> so Rachel and Susie played game after game. They won so many stuffed toys that they couldn't hold them. Now, squeaked Rachel excitedly, now let's ride the whale back roller coaster, please. But Rachel, Susie said, we can't carry all these prizes. We should take them home first. No way, yelled Rachel. I ate when you wanted to eat. I played games when you wanted to play games. Now it's time for the real fun. Let's ride the rides. Look, the lockers are over there. Now, look at the picture and what do you see? See, their arms are full of little stuffed teddy bears and stuffed puppies and a little piggy. So now, they can put the stuffed animals in a locker so they can ride the ride. Let's turn the page. Susie told Rachel that she just had to go to the bathroom and then call her mother. Rachel rolled her eyes and said, you're just a scaredy cat. Have you ever done that? Roll your eyes like, oh, oh, you're a scaredy cat. Oh, no, no, not me. I'm not afraid of anything, Susie said with pride. 
Susie left Rachel sitting outside by the burst the balloon game. Susie called her mother and spoke to her for a very long time. And her mother said, it's okay to be afraid. Everyone is afraid sometimes. Then she told Susie to say a prayer and ask Jesus to help her not to be afraid when she rides the rides. Okay, mommy, I will, Susie said. And she swam back to Rachel. Now, are you ready? Let's ride the Whaleback Roller Coaster, Rachel demanded. Okay, but will I fall out, Susie asked. No way, the seatbelts are real tight, Rachel said. Do you think she's going to be brave and ride the roller coaster? It was good that her mommy told her to pray and ask Jesus to help her. Let's turn the page. As the girls were being strapped in, the ride operator yelled, hold on tight. Susie wanted to jump out, but the seatbelt held her tight. Then she remembered her mother said to say a prayer to Jesus when she felt afraid. So Susie prayed, please Jesus, help me not be afraid and keep me safe, amen. You can pray that too. Please, Jesus, help me not be afraid and keep me safe. Amen. That's a good prayer. Can you see? Can you see that Susie is praying and Rachel has her mouth open because she's so excited? Let's turn the page. What happened next? <gasps> up, 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 the roller coaster climbed. Higher, higher, higher went the girls. Wow, I can see the whole park and corral hood from up here, shouted Susie. It's so beautiful. I've never seen anything like this before. Wow, they're really high. The roller coaster zoomed down the first hill, up the second hill, and back down again. The girls screamed at the top of their gills. <laughs> they went, it was so fast, they could barely hold on. Wow. Does that look like fun to you? How about you? Does it look like fun? Miss Patty Cake likes roller coasters. I think they're lots of fun. Let's see what Susie and Rachel said. When the ride was finished, Rachel asked, are you ready to go on another ride? I want to go on the Whaleback Roller Coaster again, Susie said in excitement. <laughs> the girls giggled as they raced to get in line for the second time. Would you like to do that? Would you like to ride a second time? Wow, that's what the girls did. Let's see what it says. Rachel asked, want to ride the Danger Dragon Coaster? It's higher, higher than the Whaleback Roller Coaster, unless you're too scared. <laughs> Oh, no. No, not me. I'm not afraid of anything, and I mean anything. Jesus gives me courage. Jesus is the best friend anyone could have, and he's always with us, said Rachel. The day before school was to start, Rachel asked, Do you want to go to the new water park and ride the water rides? Or are you afraid? Oh, no. No, not me. I'm not afraid because all I have to do is say a prayer and ask Jesus to keep me safe, Susie said with a big smile. The girls swam as fast as they could to get to the new water park. Can you see all the bubbles? That shows you how fast they're swimming, going straight to the water park. Are you ready to slide down the huge water slide? Asked Rachel. Yes, I am. I am ready to ride all the water rides. Let's go, said Susie. After they rode the water rides, they decided to eat dinner at the Twisted Water Cafe. After dinner, Susie gave Rachel a big hug and said, thank you, Rachel, for being such a good friend. And I thank Jesus for turning my fears into faith. Did you know Jesus can turn your fears into faith? That means you can trust him and you don't have to be afraid. That's what Susie learned. Remember kids to say your prayers 
and always have Jesus in your heart. The end of I'm Not Afraid by Leanne Mancini. You can find a copy of this book at glmpublishing.net or on Amazon.com. Remember, subscribe, like, and click the bell.